Hey guys, so um, I'm gonna hopefully get the Comic Con video done today. That's the game. I don't know if I will. It'll be Thursday or Friday at the latest. Oh, okay. Sorry, there's a post on Twitter, not Twitter, Facebook there. I'll come back to that. Just want to let you know, I came home yesterday. I immediately started planning my next cosplay. Because I was thinking about the masquerade, the way Foxy had acted, the way he'd been like, you know, snapping at the audience, been very, pretty aggressive, things like that. And I thought next year I'd actually like to get judged on. So I thought, how about doing another animatronic? And obviously, you know, I asked for a vote to do another animatronic. And Kai's mentioned the pop up did not win, but he's going to do, be done in. It was, I was going to do all three anyway, but the pop up's going to be done in Halloween. And I remember thinking, what other animatronic could you do? And then I thought, yes, I know the majority of it was for Bonnie, but Bonnie is very popular. So I thought, I don't know. And I thought, there's one you could do. And there's a good fit, bit of acting you could do. And it involves a certain spring lock suit. I don't really know why I'm giving you clues. Basically, I got the idea to do spring trap. So I thought, I know Bonnie's popular. I know loads of people wanted Bonnie. And I apologise that I may not be doing them. But the reason being is because, well, essentially spring trap is spring Bonnie. For a start. And I think he'd be just cool. He'd be quite good to make him. For a start, he has five fingers for Bonnie has four. I think it'd be quite difficult to make gloves for Bonnie. That's just one example. But yeah, so essentially I'm still making Bonnie, but just a different version of Bonnie. But I sort of thought in the masquerade I could do it when like he's sitting on the ground, like slouched over. You know, it'd be like sitting like I can't obviously can't do it because like, the camera's view is limited. But like when he's like that and then he maybe starts twitching, you know, like you no know, like when the spring locks snap. So maybe he starts twitching, then he just like, drops, sits limp for a few seconds, looks up slowly, maybe he lifts his hands and starts examining his hands. So he's sort of like, I'm not getting, it's sort of like almost like, really, it's just like I'm not getting out of this. And then maybe he starts getting up and starts walking around, he's maybe glaring at the audience or something, I don't know, doing something. But um, yeah, I'm going to go a wee bit more all out with, bon with Bonnie, with Springtrap. I'm thinking of putting a speaker in that will maybe one, change my voice, I might put like a little microphone here. Where I can change my voice and then also I'm thinking of doing it where I would like to do it where I can get his eyes to move like maybe left and right so far that's not really been a, an option because I haven't worked out how to do it yet the speaker pardon me looks very possible I just think also spring trap would be more challenging than Bonnie and obviously more challenging than Foxy you see, um loads of people are sending me photos with Foxy so they're gonna be in the video hopefully um I would love to get a video of him in the masquerade but I don't think anyone filmed it unfortunately or if anyone got any photos in the masquerade, actually, that'd be good as well. But yeah, so so guys, there you are. Spring Trap's going to be worked on over the summer. The video will be the same format as Foxy. And then Spring Trap will be one of the characters most likely going to Comic Con next year. The other cosplay, I don't know yet. It might be something, it might be another Disney character. I might consider letting Frodo go. I don't, probably, I don't, probably not. I don't really know yet, but we'll see what happens. So yeah, guys, thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time. Bye.